They didn't start the tradition, they just embodied it and made it stronger. The Germantown Friends School boys and girls track and field teams have a history of excellence, but that doesn't continue without hard work and dedication. It's so important. I think like uh, some of the some of the rhetoric around running is like about luck and about like pure talent, but I think that such a percentage of it is showing up and consistency and um, it's nice to get recognized and to watch that pay off. Both programs added to the trophy case this spring by winning their respective Friends League championships. The boys team defended their title and won the league for an unprecedented 21st time in just 40 years. It was their 14th championship since the turn of the century. Yeah, you know, just being able to show what we've been training for for the last couple of months has been really exciting today. Um, you know, getting out here and just having some fun and just racing was, I think, what was able, what allowed us to win today. Like coming out and getting to show all the younger guys who didn't see it the past couple of years, like what this is all about and to be able to be one of the leaders to do that, it's just, it's really special. For the girls, it was a climb back to the top. The Tigers won the league for the first time since 2015 with the help of a deep roster that stepped up in the spotlight. Oh my gosh, this team is, this team is crazy. I mean, we've got girls who've never stepped foot on a track ever who are now winning like several events today and you know, being in the top three at, in, at a very competitive like league level, which is, is honestly crazy. And you know, the future for this team is so bright. The girls team won for the 17th time in school history, which is the most by any in the friends league. The girls team is rightfully earning their own recognition. Our boys program just is more established in terms of their their um, winning streak, so it was really cool to, to watch everyone on our team put in a lot of work and get the, the girls title this year. It starts with hard work. It's fueled by camaraderie. A lot of the times it's just goofiness, but when it's time when it's time to go, everyone is pushing everyone else and we all like there's also none of that negativity when like your teammate beats you, it's all love. Um, definitely gets you fired up deep down, but it's a lot of a lot of love among us. So it's good. We have like a great camaraderie and um, levity going on and like are a very goofy bunch and it's when we go to some larger invites and see the dynamics of other teams, it's a nice reminder of like how lucky we are to have this group. And for the seniors, it'll be tough to leave. It's kind of, it's, it's crazy to think that I'm, you know, finally a senior and, you know, I'm ready to go to college and, you know, explore a little bit more. But, man, it's been such a part of my life for so long that, you know, it is a little bittersweet leaving, but I, I know I'm leaving it in good hands and everyone here is so great, so I'm really happy. Dude, I don't even know. I can, I'm, we, have, we had so many alumni back just to watch this today, and I know I'm going to be back next year just watching these guys, but, yeah, miss it a lot.